and welcome to WPLMS tutorials. In this tutorial, we are going to learn how the manage questions section in the course panel for the instructor's work. So this is a new section in WPLMS version four. Here the instructor can see all the questions that has been uploaded by him. Now this is like a question bank which the instructor can maintain and it, it is going to show the questions in a in a table and here it shows the question ID title type then when this question was created question tags and the attempts how many attempts have been made and how many of those attempts were correct and you can also see that we have few tabs on the top which is the add question so here the instructor can add any question manually and add the question so once the question is added you can see the question appears the other way of adding questions in the question bank is to download the sample and here the user will select which question type the user is going to import. For instructor's purpose, we have created easy to understand DSV files, import files. So let's download this and edit this. Right. So here you can see that we have this file. So the first row is the title row, which tells us what the what the fields below it mean. For example, we have the question title, then we have the question tags separated by a pipe. So which means that we have will be adding two tags, which is geography and capitals. So the tags are very important in creating dynamic quizzes because they help you in uh, categorizing the questions together. Then we have the question statement, then we are writing the options. And you can add more options. And the name of this should be option with the capital O. And you can add more options and you can type in the correct option. For clarity's sake, we advise you to copy the option and paste it in the correct options place. Then the hint and the explanation. And to add more questions, you can simply duplicate this field. So you can copy the entire field and paste it and so once you have prepared your file you can take an export into the csv format you can test it in our importer so we upload the file and you'll see that the questions will appear in your question bank that our question bank is ready we can test these questions by creating a new quiz so we go to the manage quizzes and add a new quiz once our quiz is ready it's, it is time to attempt the quiz so we start the quiz and we can see our imported questions appearing correctly and we can check the question bank and it is and it will show the number of attempts and the correct attempts so that's it from wplms tutorials thanks for watching